Hello again. Today we're going to be making this cute, cute, cute little egg. Look, it looks like my face almost if I hold it like this. Ah! <laughs> okay, so to my subscribers, I love you. Let's stop yapping and let's start crocheting. Here's what I'm using today. I'm using these yarns for the egg. I might stuff it, I don't know yet. And then if you want to put a face on it, I would get some black yarn and maybe some safety eyes and then a yarn needle. Oh, and I'm using a 5.5 .5 hook. We're gonna start with my least favorite thing in crochet, a magic ring. Sorry if you don't know how to do a magic ring, you might need to look it up. I always chain one because I that's the only way I know how to do a magic ring, guys, but don't worry, it doesn't, it doesn't affect anything. Then we're gonna do six single crochets into the ring. Once you have your six single crochets, we're gonna pull the tail and pray that it closes, which it did. And then we are going to do an increase in each stitch around. An increase, I-N-C, means two, oh gosh, this is the hardest one, two single crochets in each stitch. So it should be a total of 12 stitches this round. I hope that made sense. And I will see you once you increase in each stitch. Awesome. Now we're going to do a single crochet. And then we're going to do an increase. A total of six times. So once again, we're going to do a single crochet. And then an increase, which you guys know what that means now. All the way around should be a total of 18 stitches. So far, so good. This round, we're going to do two single crochets, one in each stitch, and then an increase, a total of six times. All the way around, it should be 24 stitches. I think you guys got it. I'll, uh, look in the top right, that's the pattern, and if you need help reading it, reach out to me. This next part is going to get so crazy, you guys. I actually don't even know what I'm going to do yet, but I want the egg to be lopsided. And this is where crochet becomes an art because this is going to be a masterpiece. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do a single crochet, another single crochet, and then I'm thinking I'm going to put four stitches in this next one, four single crochets in this next stitch. Now you guys can do kind of whatever you want to do on this. Like I'm just gonna put a bunch of stitches in some random places so that my egg is a little lopsided. So I'm gonna do four there and then maybe in the next stitch I'll do two just to kind of like level it out. I don't, I don't even know. I'm gonna write the pattern that I'm doing in the top right but I don't know what I'm gonna do. Oh, this is crazy. This is crazy. This, is, this might be too much. Then I'm gonna do, let's do three single crochets after that. I'm also talking out loud to myself so I can write this <coughs> so I can write this down later. Sorry, that was probably not a great sound. Okay, then okay, so we just did three single crochets. So let's do two single crochets in the same stitch after that. This is insane. This is insane. And then let's do three single crochets in the same stitch after that. I hope this turns out well. Okay, then let's let's chill out. Let's do four regular single crochets, one in each stitch. Okay, you don't want to get too crazy. You don't want to try too hard, you know? Like, we don't want to show off. Okay, that was enough chilling out. Let's do three single crochets in this next one, in the same stitch. Okay, we're going to do three. And then we're going to do two single crochets in the next stitch. And let's chill out again. Like my heart rate is probably up right now. Let's just do three regular single crochets. And remember, I'm going to write the pattern in the top right if you want to copy me. Or you can kind of just do what I'm doing and go with the flow. Because there's no right or wrong here. Okay, what did I just do? Okay, now I'm going to do... 
four single crochets in this stitch. One, two, three, four in the same stitch. And then let's do two single crochets in the same stitch in the next one. Because I feel like you can't just go from four to one. I'm rambling. I'm rambling. Let's just end. Let's just, let's just single crochet the rest of the way. One, two. Oh, gosh. I, I hope this turns out well. Three, four. I hope you guys are with me and I, that you don't unsubscribe because I love you guys. Okay. And then after you did that, after you're done with your crazy row... We're just going to do a single crochet all the way around. Use a stitch marker, okay? I just use a piece of yarn so that you know when you made it to the end. Or do whatever you want. I don't care. All right, I'm going to leave you be. So do that, and then in the next row, just single crochet all the way along. And, oh, I am praying that it looks decent because I don't know yet. All right, see you soon. This actually turned out fantastic. So when you're done and satisfied... I'm just going to slip stitch because that's what I like to do at the end. Cut it and then tie it and we're moving on to the yoke. I'm going to go really fast on this part because it's the same setup as making the egg white. But we're going to magic ring first. And then we're going to do six single crochets inside of our ring. Once you have your six single crochets in there, pull the string tight to close it up. And then do an increase in each stitch. You guys know what an increase is. Two single crochets in each stitch. Then we're going to repeat six times. We're going to do a single crochet. And then an increase all the way around. Should be 18 stitches. The next two rows will be easy peasy. We're just going to single crochet in each stitch. Should be 18 for each row. Fantastic. When you're done, cut a really long tail so we can sew it in. The longer, the better. I'm going to do this much just in case. And, oh, and you can tie it off. Now I'm going to use 9 millimeter safety eyes. They look kind of funny, not in the thing. And guys, this is your project, but if you want to see where I'm going to put them, I don't know. I'm going to look at the center. I'm going to kind of just go diagonal. Maybe in this row, the second row. Is that the second row or is that the third row? I don't know. You guys are probably going to do a better job of placing them than me. So just try your best. It looks pretty good to me. Let's move on to the mouth. Okay, time for this stupid little smile. Everybody that knows this channel knows I don't know how to explain this. So maybe watch as I do and don't do as I say would be my best advice. So I, I would just keep watching what I'm doing. And must I say, it never turns out well for me anyways. And I'm probably going to delete this video and I'm probably going to get upset. Hopefully not. Okay, wait, this actually is looking like it could be okay. Uh, okay, and then I'm going to go... This sucks. This honestly sucks. I don't... This really does. I, I don't even know. I'm going to ruin my whole project because of this stupid smile. Oh, okay, I hope it's in camera. It doesn't even matter because I'm probably going to delete it anyways. Uh, wait, I'm actually going to keep that. Did you guys see that? I hope you saw it. If not, ugh, the one time I do it right and I just am rambling about nothing. Well, that's how you do a smile. Just go look it up if you don't know how to do it, okay? All we got to do now is connect the two together. So looking at your little egg white, I'm going to count one, two, three down. And I think this circle moment we have going on here, this third row is where I'm going to connect my thing. There's something very important, though. We are only going to go through the top on the egg white, okay? I mean, you don't need to, but I don't want there to be yellow below. Does that make sense? Like, I don't want it to be yellow below. Like, I don't want... I want to be able to flip it over and it's white. Does that make sense? Okay. So, we're just going to go through the top, and then we're going to go through the yellow. And must I say again, you guys, it really does not matter if this doesn't look great. 
But I'm sure it will. I'm sure it will. But I'm just saying, if you're like stressed out, like, oh, is this right? Is this right? Oh, I don't know if I'm doing it right. Stop. Like, there's so many other things that you need to worry about than if this egg yolk connects to this egg white. Okay? Just try your best is what I'm trying to say. But remember, so we're going to go through the yellow. And then we're going to go through... Wait, where is the third row? It doesn't even matter, right? Is that the third row? We're just going to go through the top of the egg white, okay? Yeah, you got it. I'm going to leave you. Oh, I forgot I was literally making a video on this, and I literally finished it, so I'm so sorry. And I forgot to tell you guys to stuff it before you close it up, but I'll try to warn you. To anybody still watching, I love you. And I hope your egg turned out just as good as mine. And if I never see you again, I hope you have a good life.